Okay, welcome to Cocktails and Conversation brought to you by One Cocktail at a Time. I am your host, Alexis, and tonight we were joined with by my partner, Tasha, who we're going to be making her cocktail fashioned. So we're both going to make it. I'll make mine my way, but I'm sure she has some special twists as we go along. So, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it looks like you're in a Caribbean island or something. <laughs> and you're the, the breeze blowing. Friend, good to see you. Good to see you too. Can't even believe it. Oh, let's make cocktails. Let's make my favorite old fashioned. <laughs> so we should start with um, I'm going to hand sanitize because I'm outside and I don't. Okay. And my and our friend uh, Eileen is probably going to be joining me, so I'm making two. So okay. I, my face mask, I have my wipes, and I have some Coppercraft Distillery uh, hand, hand sanitizer. Um, I'm going to start with sugar cube. How are you doing it? Um, actually, I'm doing it the um, the quick and easy way. I have pre-made simple syrup. Usually, I make simple syrup on my own, but I don't have any. But you can always um, cheat and buy some simple syrup. Right. And I'm a traditionalist. I like mine with the sugar cube. And since I'm making two, I put two sugar cubes in here. Normally, okay. I would put one. And next, what do we do, Tasha? Next, you add, you add your simple syrup. Okay. Okay. I, I add my bourbon. Oh, she does her bourbon next. Okay. I, but no, no, it, no, not being funny. I, um, I go with my orange bitters, which are my favorite. I add orange bitters. I almost brought that out, but I decided to go traditional. And because I am muddling my cubes, I have to put a We're mixing it up a little bit. You're going to do yours, I'm going to do mine. We're going to mix it up a little bit. Okay. And I usually do um, maybe two splashes of orange bitters. Okay. I did that. I, you've already got your bourbon in, so I gotta pour mine in. I'm well, no, I didn't. I didn't put it in. I actually, um, I was being good. I didn't. What, uh, what bourbon are you using tonight? I'm using Woodford Reserve. So I'm using tonight um, Redwood Empire American Whiskey, okay. and it's based out of um, California. So I'm not going the traditional Kentucky route. I'm mixing up my old fashioned. Mixing it up. And I have four ounces, two per of and then I'm stirring with the sugar. Okay. So we both have our bourbon and sugar and bitters already. Did you already add your yep. Yes, I did. Catch up. <laughs> I'm adding my ice. And then I'm going to stir. I like to stir, as I've said in previous videos, about, I'm going to stir it about 40 times. I really want to get this nice and diluted. And then I got to put my ice in my glass. Right. You stir more than, you store more than me, friend. You stir way more than me. Friend. You like yours a little stronger, not as uh, diluted? Is that what you're saying? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> he wants to <laughs> bourbon. I like a mellow. I like a mellow. Oh, I forgot my strainer. Girl, I'll be right back. Look at you. Yeah. Yeah. Got it? Yeah. yeah. And we will any kind to garnish? I've got my Luxardo cherry, and I forgot my orange. I usually use Luxardos too, but I found at the grocery store, and I just had to try them. Mm -hmm. Higher in the spiced cherries by Sweet Kitchen. <gasps> oh, wow. That sounds amazing. Just a little kick to them. You probably like them. Do you add any cherry juice to yours or anything, or are you just straight up the simple, the, the bitters? Yeah, I. Uh, it depends on what kind of mood I'm in, but normally I do not. 
So if I make it for Ryan, aka Biggs, I'll put a little cherry juice in for for Ryan. Okay. I did. Um, oh. ooh, a bug flew into my drink. Here it is. Protein in my drink here. <laughs> oh, look at it! So it's good. I put a little dip of the spicy cherry juice in here. Are you ready to do a, ch a toast or a cheers? Yeah. Cheers to never being the only one in the room. Cheers. One cocktail at a time. Cocktail at a time. Mm.